Assalamu alaikum. Finally, our first cat video. Hooray! Hello and welcome to the Hadith channel, a channel that shares Hadith to you. Okay, before the Hadith, if you aren't subscribed, please subscribe. You'll receive notifications. If you click the notifications bell, you'll receive videos from the Hadith channel every Sunday, inshallah. This video will be about how to treat your cat the Sunnah way and the rights of a cat. Some rights also apply for other animals. Okay, starting with the Hadith. Narrated by Ibn Umar radiallahu anh, the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, A woman entered hellfire because of a cat which she had tied, neither giving it food, uh, n neither giving it food nor setting it free to eat from the vermin of the earth. Sahih al-Bukhari. This means if anyone tortures a cat or any other animal, they, were, uh, they will enter hell. Narrated by Asma bint Abi Bakr, the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam prayed, the eclipse prayer and then said hell was displayed so close that I said oh my lord am I going to be one of its inhabitants suddenly he saw a woman I think he said who was being scratched by a cat he said what is wrong with her he was told she had imprisoned it that is the cat till it died of hunger Sahih al-Bukhari this means killing cats intentionally will lead to hell obvious statement Abu Zubair uh, said I asked Jabir about the price of a dog and a cat. He said Allah's Messenger وسلم, disapproved of that. This meant that the Prophet وسلم, did not permit the selling of cats. It was narrated from Abu Hurairah عنه, that the Messenger of Allah وسلم, said cats do not invalidate the prayer because they are one of the things that are useful in the house of Allah. This means cats are allowed in masajid. Okay, it seems that you have been listening till the end. Congratulations, may Allah bless you. Click on the, on the like button if you learned something new. And until next Sunday, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.